what is slut? Where's this being sluts? Cockbite sluts. Cockbiting sluts. Cock sluts. Hello everyone, welcome to the Lego Studios. My name is Mr. Gloves, and this is another... Cock sluts. T box. Unslutifying. Ah, stress ball. Ah, basketball. I've, I've actually been needing this. <laughs> LeBrick James, bitch. With fucking explosions going off all around the house and shit. Ah, uh, now you too can be LeBrick James. <laughs> is he a Nazi? Because that has a Nazi logo on it. It's got the Fundenhausen. Yeah, exactly. The Fundenhausen. T-shirt. You got a T-shirt? I, I always get the T-shirt with this box. Beep. It's a T-shirt. It does T-shirt stuff. Like, be warned. Like teeth. Rooster teeth. I, all I can see is stare teeth. Rooster teeth. It says rooster teeth. Oh, really? And there's some graphics. Uh, yeah. There's some... Rooster teeth. Oh yeah. Various four. insignias. We have grapes. We have they, grapes. They do. Oh yeah, that's there. right. April first was their fourteenth year anniversary, which means they celebrated with grapes. Fourteen grapes. April. In paradise. Eighth is my was my fourteenth year anniversary of watching Rooster Teeth. Because I watched. That I is had, a less celebrated uh, milestone, but. <laughs> to you, very important and cherished. It that's, is. That's good. That's good. We've been watching this since 2003. Yeah, good for you. Fucking the the first episode of Red vs. Blue Amount came of out. other people caring. Zero. The first <laughs> red, the first uh, episode of Red vs. Blue came out. A week later, I watched that, and just as I finished watching that, the second one was posted. Like literally, like it was. There was only one. I watched so you're it. You're a week behind. Fuck you. Did you ever catch up? Yeah, I okay. caught up. Just, I caught just up. Checking. I caught up immediately. Just making sure. I'm just saying that they that video got posted on on like uh, for download on their website. This is before YouTube. You actually had to download the fucking video. And now they're able to make Funden housing balls. <laughs> and like it, it got posted while I was watching the first one. I don't know. I always felt mid watch. Like that that always felt a little special <laughs> to me. This is my video. No, no, not that. Not. In they did it for me. Oh, that's so funny. They did it for me. Hey! I like look. Speaking of red versus blue. See, I guess if if I guess if you were, you weren't cuz they just did like first week to try to get people to sign up for uh, first membership. That's why they gave them one ball. And I guess they get their second ball next week. If you missed this little notepad in this pen, guess what? You can uh, you could have gotten this little notepad. And this little pen. You could have two pens. This one says red versus blue, the, but the original one says rooster snaps. Either way, you'd have two pens, which is enough to stab out both of a person's eyes. And they both have... Good on your rooster teeth! <laughs> and they both have a stylus, that way you can use it on your phone. But I won't demonstrate that, because last time it took a long time for me to do that. <laughs> <laughs> you are the poor demonstration master. <sighs> well, you... you you had fun with the first page of my notebook. Master of shitty demonstrations. So you may as well have fun with the first page of this one. Just don't fucking rip it. And handoffs. What? <laughs> Take your ball. Take your ball and go home. I am home. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> I know, and I had to remind you of that. Hey, I got headphones. Red versus blue. Green headphones. It's not a push pen, just for those of you at home. Nah, it's a twisty pen. It's a twisty pen. If, if it catches you off guard. <laughs> In case you're watching this for advice on how to activate the pen that you got in your Rooster Teeth box. It's probably it's a, a very similar make. If it says red versus blue on it. And you're it writing red space versus pen. blue. I actually, I don't know. We'd have to test it in space. It could be a space pen. Possible space pen from Rooster Teeth. Go to our Patreon to send us to space so we can test this pen. We have a Patreon? Don't go to a Patreon that says it's us, because it's not us. That is somebody else trying to make $4 a year. Off of our videos. Off of our, off of our stuff. Oh, and, oh the, and I hopefully not succeeding. Hopefully they only get a buck eighty. It's one of the ones where you have to split it yourself. <laughs> I like that. It's like the uh, fruit roll-up of headphones. Oh, those actually fit quite comfortably. And they're quite noticeable. I can't even hear the construction. Oh, that's nice. What? I said that's nice. What? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. 
It's unfortunate that the headphones themselves don't have this symbol on them, but eh, whatever. I need headphones. Sex swing sticker going on the sticker box. Sex swing sticker going on the sticker box. Sex swing sticker going on the sticker box. I turned the show into a race war. <laughs> but it's a race war of unity. Because there's red and blue, and then all of the other colors, which is like all most of the other people, join forces. So it's about bringing, it's uniting, not dividing. Hmm. It's a show of unification. Actually, this is the one sticker that I won't post right now. I'm going to put it on the back of it. On the thing that's on the back of it. In the bottom. Sex swine! Swing. Oh. There's a G at the end. <laughs> swing! <laughs> sex swine! I like sex the swine. The best part is, like, he legitimately thought it said sex swine. <sighs> well, maybe they're marketing a new brand of wine called <laughs> sex wine. You know, you could have also just listened as they started yelling sex swing sticker going on the sticker box. Which, that song was a lie. I am sorry. Sex why? I am sorry for lying during that song, but it's going on the back of this little red versus the blue. The pig book. of sex. <laughs> Wild poor fucks. <laughs> that actually sounds like an album. <laughs> Wild poor fucks. That sounds like a band name. <laughs> the Wild Boar Fucks. And their debut album, Slutification. It's a This time, it does not appear. I got a signed card. You got a signed card again? No, I did not. You get a signed cardigan? No. Ah, damn it. Next time, Rooster Teeth, we want signed cardigans. <laughs> yeah! For no reason. We won't. I don't we know what will happen to them, but. But that's what I still have that signed card that I'm super fucking happy about. This is Achievement Hunter card. Oh, so it probably would have been... people. All right, so I'm actually not as happy. That probably would have had, like, it's six signatures on it if it had been signed. Or just a random one of them. Or that. That is also possible. The other ones were like, nah, I'm not sticking in. But at the same time... I'm not sticking to stay in late. But at the same time, I got one of the original creators of the show, Matt Hollum, who also plays, like, two of my favorite characters from Rapids. Comprised exclusively of the most intellectually devoid semen samples the human race has to offer. That's what it actually says, isn't it? No. Oh. This it actually sounds like something that they would write. That's what I turned it into. <laughs> Comprised exclusively of the most intellectually advanced specimens the okay the human race has to offer. I see. I the turned specimens into semen. The secret, <laughs> the secret cabal known as the ancient hunt, the, the ancient hunters, the achievement hunters, <laughs> spend their nights working He's as an unseen pot. force dedicated to solving the world's geopolitical, environmental, and economic problems with the power of their collective genius. During the day, they drunkenly shout obscenities and vulgar jokes into webcams while playing mindless video games. But at night, they pass out angrily and do nothing. It doesn't say what they do at night. I want to know pass what they Pass out do at angrily night. and I, do nothing. I know exactly what they do during the day. Tell me what they do during the night. Tell me. Tell me. Night stories. <laughs> with Clark Clarksley. What was that book? Uh, scary Stories to Tell in the Dark. Yes. I like that. That, those books are that book was stupid, because how are you supposed to read it in the dark? <laughs> Scary stories <laughs> to tell in the dark. It's fucking dark. How are you reading a book? Because you can just have the aneurysm. <laughs> what a dumb freaking title. When you're completely in the dark, read this book. It's just white pages. There's actually no words on it, because you're reading it in the dark. You're just making it up. <laughs> It's like, make your own adventure, only all the words are yours. They weren't about to bother to type anything. At the just... center of every page, it just says, the person reading this book is an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> you are dumb, period. 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 You are dumb, comma. You are dumb, period. 
<laughs> you are dumb. Semicolon. <laughs> Oxford comma. <laughs> <laughs> Parentheses. Apostrophe. You were dumb. <laughs> F-U. Period. Comma. Space. Tilde. Period. Tilde. Tilde, do you part? Tilde, I do not like you more than Hilde. <laughs> Be dead. <laughs> How much more time do you think we have before another blast goes? <laughs> I don't know. Bill blast with ah uh, cigarette like window. I don't know. It's weird cigarette window day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this Am I gonna walk out to an explosion? <laughs> I don't know. This kid was sitting around for thirty minutes waiting to go smoke a cigarette. He does. Less than five minutes later. They may have been waiting for me. Like, okay, let's wait for this guy to go out and have a cigarette. Finally! And then all the while, I was waiting for them to blast. They were waiting for me to get the shit going. <laughs> but I think I'm giving myself way too much credit, because they just do whatever the hell they want to do. Yeah, they do. <laughs> they were very nice to let me out and go to work, though, so that was cool. Not me! <laughs> they just tore up the road and... Left my car stranded in the driveway. Yeah, they were like, oh, yeah, we'll clear it. They, like, went behind and, like, cleared a path for me, like, out of the, they laid everything down and ground it all down and made it be a nice path. I wish I got the king's treatment. <laughs> I felt very pampered. It was, uh, it was kind of awesome. Dickhead. Sweet. They obviously like me much more than you. Dickhead. They're fans of smokers, apparently, so you're being discriminated against. How does it feel? You know, it's not that much different from when I was a smoker. Well, now that you've stopped, you're being discriminated against for not smoking. Yeah, it seems like we're... In your face! Seems like we all just hate each other for not being each other. For whatever reason, do you smoke? No, I hate you! He said, yes, I also would have hated you, but for a completely different reason, I would have said. <laughs> I, I just... would have said! I just hate <laughs> people. <laughs> <laughs> and you are person. Not even actually, like, not even like, I would have hated you for a completely different reason. Not that I believe. Actual, <laughs> just, <laughs> just whatever I would have come just, up with in the moment. I would have said. <laughs> a different reason that I would have come up with. Whatever I think would have pissed you off. <laughs> that's what would have come out of my mouth, because you're a dumb asshole, and I fucking hate you. It's nice to do videos again <laughs> with you, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> I mean, thank you? I don't know. I've missed it. <laughs> Politeness. <laughs> anyway. What's up, dickheads? Oh, it's Jeff. Jeff here. Talk. What's up, smarmy cockswank? Jeff here, taking 45 seconds out of my sabbatical to write the shitty letter Owner for you. Owner of a swanky cock. This month's double gold That's their first album, Owner of a Swanky Cock. This month's... <laughs> We're the owners of a swanky corks club da, 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 da. We only play inside of clubs da, 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 da. I'll play this out <laughs> It's totally out of tune, but go for it Oh, it's small Yeah, no shit It's a fucking ukulele It's not a guitar I minim <laughs> miniaturized We'll just stick to one string at a time. That's it's fine. A, it's a really attitude. Oh, I yeah. can't hold uh, it. Uh, I, I guess I could stand. I would, yeah, I'd have to get a pick and start doing it with my right hand. Yeah, a pick would be useful for this. I feel like I haven't played anything in a long time. A, I have picks in my in my. Uh, uh, I hope you're enjoying this as we oh, dissect. Oh, we probably edited a lot of this out. But oh, I don't know. We haven't yet. Listen to my thoughts I save on the ukulele. Anyway. What's up, dickhead? Jeff here, taking 45 seconds out of my sabbat sabbatical to write this shitty letter for you. This month's double gold RT box has some stuff in it. There's a funhouse chess ball to throw at people. Some achievement... You ball-throwing <laughs> demon. Some achievement under earbuds to throw at people. You saw I that? almost <laughs> caught that. You saw that coming. <laughs> Uh, and red versus blue and notepad to write down ideas for things to throw at people. Then, of course, there is an extra special Rooster Teeth 14th anniversary tea to celebrate the fact that we somehow still managed to exist. Uh, we also threw in a Sex Wing sticker. Ooh. So you can show the world That's that you have an amazing taste. 
Last but not least, you're the lucky recipient of card number two of 12 of the season one Rooster Teeth Gold cards, which will ship in every RT box. About 20% of these cards were signed by some idiots at Achievement Hunter, so I would like to apologize in advance to anyone who gets one. Oh, yeah, it was some idiot. So, yeah, it would have been a, a couple signatures. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. A couple of a couple of random peeps. Nice to you guys who actually got it. I was so happy with the Matt Holm one I got. <laughs> and that's just the thing. is like, if you get all 12 boxes, you're guaranteed to fucking get at least one signed card. <laughs> nope. There's no guarantee. Each one has an equal opportunity of failure. That is true. Just they, like every person that shat out of somebody's vagina. The 20% does not increase per... Uh, batch, does it? No, nope, it's just twenty percent. It's like the theory of flipping three coins. The third one is still fifty. All 50. you have is twelve eighty percent chances of losing. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff that in your throats like Adrian Peterson stuffs leaves in his son's mouth and beats him about the scrotum. Woo! <laughs> you sons of bitches. Woo! <laughs> Real life, he did that. Whoa! The worst case scenario is another cool thing you can throw at people, but I'm not gonna throw this at you. Back to my sabbatical. Le sabbatical. Leave me alone. Jeff. Technically, that's Jeff's signature. <laughs> so. Just not actually signed by him. Yes, yeah. <laughs> And that's your RT box. I'm happy. I'm so happy with this one. See, we, we've been talking recently. Uh, loot crate boxes, we're done. We're, 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 we're done with loot crate boxes. Loot crate. It's not easy to rock out. I have to go backwards. I can't go backwards. That's odd. <laughs> <laughs> and your other I have to learn how to play. How to do it. <laughs> well, it's going to have to fucking learn. <laughs> It's just gonna have to do Although this way does not work at all with the the monkey. <laughs> the monkey! Fuck you, monkey! That's much better. There we go. Now I can learn how to play the other handed. The other handed. It's the same basic. Concept. It's the same basic fucking concept. It shouldn't be this difficult. I just love the first. <laughs> so yeah, loot crate's done. I can't move this at all. Okay. Loot crate done. We stopped having fun doing loot crate, but we're still having fun with the RT box. We're still having fun with Pro Wrestling Crate. So those will still be recorded. As long as we're still gonna record those, yeah. As, uh, depending Don't hand me stuff to, that can occupy me, because I'll just <laughs> depending on whether or not random notes. Pro Wrestling Crate continues to come. It may need to be renewed, and whether or not he'll renew it, that's up to him. That's his fucking money. I'm not going to tell him whether or not to do it. And neither will There's you. There's a good chance that I will. Maybe with less shirts, maybe with the same amount, who knows. There's a 1% chance that that was not the number that I wanted to say. And that 1% chance just hit. Yeah, I was gonna say. So this is a day of miracles! <laughs> Because there was a 99% of chance of my failure, and I won. You have 12 chances of 80% failure. The odds of your winning at least once are infinitely the same as 80% losing. You don't need to check the math on that. We, we, we already did. You I can can't check us. the math on it because I've already forgotten the words that came out of my mouth, so you'll have to do it for me. That's why we record things like this. Balls! I have to use math now because of recording. Look for Justin's comment in the in the comments below, answering the the. Not if I club you with your own ukulele. Or if you didn't, I still haven't gotten a chance to play the game. <laughs> what game? Ukulele. Yeah, we're gonna play that next. Stay tuned. I may or may not hit him with this. I'll load. I will hit the camera. Good night. <laughs> Actually, hit the camera. It's all staged. See what I do. As I raise it, they come down like I'm gonna hit the camera, but I don't hit the camera. You see, that'd be expensive if we broke the camera every video. 
That's right, it's Flick the Monkey behind the ear. Flick you, monkey! As long as it's behind the ear, you don't just flick the monkey. That sounds really dirty. I should, yeah, there is a monkey. <laughs> I should clarify. Here, and I <laughs> behind the ear, flick Just the because my waist is not on screen <laughs> does not mean I am flicking my own bean. I am not my own Adrian Peterson child. Stop it! What? What? Why is that crossing the line? <laughs> to make fun of the guy who... No one wants to think about child. it! <laughs> Except for Adrian Peterson, yes, I know. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. He wants to live it the fucking get. <laughs> I'm waiting for you to fuck up, boy. We just had a fall. There's all kinds of leaves that I saved <laughs> in a big barrel. <laughs> Next to that barrel, I've collected sticks. I have brown ones. We don't ones. have a fireplace. I have what do brown you think ones. they're for? I have brown leaves. I have yellow leaves. They're all going to be red leaves after I'm done with you. I'll give you a hint. You should say, you asshole. Why do we besmirch Miss Hedberg's voice? I don't know. We're such terrible characters. I don't know. <laughs> we love him so much. He's one of our favorite comedians. And yet... Every time we do a horrible person who rapes and murders their own child. They get to be voiced by Miss Hedberg. <laughs> they get to be voiced by Miss Hedberg. 